Hey there, tech enthusiasts. Welcome back to Product Critique, where we dissect the latest gadgets to help you make informed buying decisions. Today, we're diving into the Amazon Fire HD 10, a budget-friendly tablet that promises big entertainment value without breaking the bank. Let's see if it lives up to the hype. The Amazon Fire HD 10 enters a crowded market of budget tablets, but does it stand out? Let's start with the design. The Fire HD 10 maintains Amazon's signature utilitarian design, featuring a durable plastic build that can withstand everyday wear and tear. It's slightly lighter and smaller than its predecessor, making it more portable without compromising on durability. The 10.1-inch FHD display delivers decent visuals for streaming movies and reading e-books. However, it lacks vibrancy and brightness compared to higher-end tablets. While it may not offer the best viewing experience, it gets the job done for casual entertainment. The Fire HD 10 runs on Fire OS 8, Amazon's custom interface based on Android 11. It's heavily integrated with Amazon's ecosystem, offering seamless access to Prime Video, Kindle Books, and more. However, the abundance of pre-installed Amazon apps and ads may feel intrusive to some users. Powered by a MediaTek chipset and 3GB of RAM, the Fire HD 10 handles basic tasks like web browsing and media consumption with ease. However, it's not suited for intensive gaming or productivity tasks. On the bright side, expandable storage up to 1TB ensures you'll never run out of space for your favorite content. With up to 13 hours of battery life, the Fire HD 10 offers decent endurance for a day of streaming and browsing. Charging via USB-C takes around 4 hours to reach full capacity, which is a bit on the slower side. In conclusion, the Amazon Fire HD 10 is a budget-friendly tablet that delivers solid entertainment value at an affordable price. While it may not offer groundbreaking features, its durability, decent display, and seamless integration. Amazon's ecosystem makes it a compelling option for casual users and Prime subscribers. That's it for today's review. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to Product Critique for more in-depth tech reviews. Thanks for watching, and until next time, happy gadget hunting!